In all, Odin crossed off 51 items from his bucket list, but in recent days, his health had worsened, and the Ledford family decided it was finally time to let him go. Odin was just four years old, and within three months, he had 7,000 followers on Facebook. People from 17 countries all watching to see where he'd show up next. There were sunsets on the beach, multiple trips for ice cream, rides in police cars, and hiking in High Point, even a trip to Hooters. Owner Bobby Joe had her favorites. One was a trip to see the Staten Island Yankees. He actually walked around all four bases. Uh, he delivered the ball to the manager. Her second might surprise you him in the tutu and the girls were dancing around him. However, in the last two days, the cancerous mass on his left leg had swollen even more and he was only walking on three legs. I just had a hard time looking at his paw being so swollen and it just reminded me that he was, could be in pain. She knew this morning after two days that it was time to take him to the veterinarian to say goodbye. When I left his side, he started to howl. So he wanted me to be with him all the time and I knew that was going to be difficult. Today he was supposed to show up at Sussex Airport to see skydivers jumping in his honor. Many of his fans also showed and after a rain delay they gave it a shot. Bobby Joe also went up just for the ride and watched as they came down. For three months Bobby Joe and husband Jeff did this. It was their therapy preparation for their loss and Jeff says it helped. We we've, we've shared experiences together uh, for years, but with Odin, it, it made us maybe open our eyes a little bit more and see that little love is a little bit more important than anything. Bobby, Joe, and Jeff say when they're ready, they will rescue another dog, and it'll likely be another St. Bernard. In Wantage, Chris Keating, News 12, New Jersey.